Pope Francis pardoned a celebrity Jesuit artist hours after the Vatican had excommunicated him. An ecclesiastical tribunal at the Dicastery of the Doctrine for the Faith excommunicated Father Marco Rupnik for absolving a woman with whom he had sexual relations. Father Rupnik is one of the most famous mosaic artists in the world. He has been commissioned by Pope St. John Paul II and Pope Francis. Francis welcomed Rupnik to a private audience in January, even after the priest sexually and physically abused consecrated women from the Loyola community in Slovenia in the 1990s. Last year, the sisters wrote three letters to Francis, but he did not respond. On Saturday, Jesuit leadership in Rome issued a statement stating that no minors were involved and restrictions on the priest were still in place. And our Rome correspondent, Dr. Jules Gomez, has dug up more details on this very fast developing story. Jules, thank you for coming on again. Good evening, James. Good to be with you as always. Always a pleasure, Jules. So the, the Jesuits say uh, no minors were involved. If That's barely any consolation, but cool, I guess. How, how many adults were victims and how is Rupnik responding to the sanctions the Jesuits have placed on him? Uh, James, uh, the Vatican is turning into a Mount Vesuvius and this is yet another massive volcanic eruption. Yes. Now, not many English media will tell you, but there were at least nine victims, consecrated sisters, uh, physically, emotionally, and sexually abused by Father Rupnik. Um, the Jesuit generalate came out with a statement rather you know, as a defense uh, mechanism, a damage control mechanism, a day after the Italian media had broken the story. And there was this rather vague deflection going on, but it did say that restrictions imposed on him, like he cannot lead mm. spiritual exercises, retreats. Uh, these continue to remain in force. But guess what? I discovered on the... Uh, website of the pontifical shrine of the holy house of loreto that our good friend rupnik is going to be leading an ignatian retreat for priests and religious from the end of february to the beginning of march so there you have it with regards to the jesuit restrictions on the artist priest so jules uh Canon law stipulates excommunication for a priest violating the confessional can you be more specific on that very briefly Yes, James, a canon 977 says that if a priest has slept with a woman, to put it crudely, he cannot hear her confession and absolve her of her sin. Mm -hmm. And canon 1378 says that if the priest breaks canon 977, he is to be excommunicated, and this excommunication is reserved to the apostolic see. This is very serious, James, because uh, 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 yeah. the auxiliary bishop has investigated this whole thing, and he says the victims are credible and their story is solid, but Rupnik is too big to fail and has too many friends in high places protecting him. Yeah, Jules, like you said, a very explosive story. Thank you so much for coming on and breaking it down for us.